हेलो फ्रेंड्स एंड वेलकम टू दिस कोर्स ऑन इम्प्लीमेंटेशन ऑफ आई एस ओ वन फाइव वन एट नाइन टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी टू स्टैंडर्ड इन मेडिकल लेबोरेटरीज सो ऑल ऑफ यू आर अवेयर दैट दिस न्यू स्टैंडर्ड विथ रिस्पेक्ट टू द मेडिकल लेबोरेटरीज हैज लॉन्च इन डिसम्बर टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी टू विच इज़ आई एस and for implementation of this new standard we have been given a period of 3 years to transfer management system of our laboratory into this new standard many of us might have undergone the 4 days program of training on internal auditing and quality management system with respect to this new standard where you might have seen the complete interpretation of this standard you might have done some exercises some group activities and you must have undergone the complete interpretation and understanding of this new standard iso 15189 2022 so there are various training courses you might have undergone but still after going through all these training courses or whatever training courses you must have undergone the question still remains the same how i should transform my laboratory with respect to this new standard or how i should implement this new standard because you have understood the standard now you have understood you have got the all implications and interpretation of all the clauses but still how i can implement this new standard in my medical laboratory from where i should start or from where i should begin and how i should start implementing how i can implement this new standard so that my laboratory will get ready you can have accreditation with respect to this new standard even if you don't want to go for your accreditation the implementation of international standard is always good for a good laboratory practice so through this short course let us see how we can implement this new standard in our laboratories so what are the main things we are going to cover in this standard or basically in this webinar let us see so basically we are going to focus on we will have a short introduction of this standard iso 15189 2022 then the overview overview or the insight of this new standard iso 15189 2022 then we will see what are the different training needs or what are the different trainings or awareness programs or awareness of documents you should be aware to implement this standard then for implementation what gap analysis you have to perform with respect to the previous standard and finally how to implement this standard in your labor so with this short introduction let us start to see the full course on implementation of new standard iso 15189 2022 in medical laboratory thank you and keep following